Mark says he knows that he would have married Lori and lived happily ever after. But that's not what happened because she mysteriously vanished on an August night in 1992. It's interesting if you turn a bright light on over a case like this and we get national attention to it, then, you know, who knows? Maybe somebody saw something. Maybe somebody remembers something uh, from that night. Maybe somebody heard somebody talking about it since then. You'll just be amazed how sometimes you, the, the, the most seemingly insignificant thing uh, can trigger something that causes a, a case to unravel. Pam Coronado has consulted as a psychic detective to more than 40 government and private agencies, including the FBI. She is also search and rescue certified and focuses much of her energy on missing persons and cold cases. Uh, she's looked into Lori's disappearance in hopes of finding some clues. So Pam, thank you for being here. Um, you. You've looked into this case, uh, anything to add? They sent me her photo, Lori's photo, and I took a look at her photo and immediately felt um, that she had been abducted against her will. I did not feel like she went intentionally with someone. Um, had the feeling that someone was waiting for her or knew where she was going to be. It, de it definitely felt like kind of like an ambush. And I kept getting the connection to somebody's father, somebody's father, somebody in your circle, possibly, Mark. I don't know what the connection is exactly, but I did feel like there was a connection through somebody's father. So either yours or one of your friends, or somehow there's a, a connection there. You said there was something had to do with a pool and a wheelbarrow. Um, so I did not feel also that she's just out in the woods. Um, I know that you had a guy that supposedly confessed and said he put her in the woods. I don't feel that that's true. I don't, um, I don't see that scenario. I keep seeing uh, a swimming pool which is an odd thing, uh, especially because I do a lot of location type work. So it was very strange to just keep seeing a swimming pool. And so I wonder if there was someone installing a pool at that time um, that could have hid her that way, but, um, or near, near a pool, which makes me think private property. Well, it's absolutely all food for thought. 